Packers with him. Yeah, Chris is stacking up a lot of playoff points. Obviously, the win here at Richmond last night. When I talked to Jason Burnett, your crew chief, he said, our car was really good on the long run, but we feel like it needs to be better on the short run today. You agree? Yeah, I do. You know, last night was, uh, you know, just a testament to these guys, you know, grinding now, making good adjustments, and, and really putting ourselves in good position to, to be able to have a shot at it at the end. Um, you know, I think tonight, if we could be a little bit faster early without – you know, damaging the tires for it later in that run. I think that was the most important piece for us. But, uh, you know, again, just really proud of our guys. Great pit stops last night. Um, we executed really well. I was super pumped to get Blake Cook and Dale Jr. Uh, and, and fill their time in victory lane. Uh, we, we made the swap t this at, uh, last night at the end of the day to frame professional iron culture. And I'll be honest with you, it'd be nothing sweeter than to, uh, to get them back in victory lane, number one, but to do uh, a back-to-back. -back. I, I keep getting screwed on this invert though <laughs> yeah. because every time we win uh it, we get inverted so I'm, I'm not a big fan of the invert right now well let's talk about the double headers they are terrific for the race teams right you knock out two races in one weekend but what are the difficult parts even for a race winning team like yours justin 100 well, they're, they're, they're great um, i hope our fans are enjoying them on, on at home on on tv i'm bummed that our fans aren't here that's probably the, the toughest part about this weekend um i, I think this would be a, a fantastic weekend for fans to be able to be here at the racetrack but what the fans don't realize is just the heartache and the hardships that it puts on our guys to, to be able to come here i stayed with the guys until almost 11 30 last night mm. getting this car try to get it turned around and being ready uh they drove 30 minutes to a hotel got about three and a half hours of sleep and had to be right back here this morning and and finish up and, and be back in the garage at, at 6 a.m and, and that's difficult um you know they're putting their, their hearts and soul into this and, and and they don't get the credit they deserve so i'm proud of my guys uh, i'm proud of all the teams really all, yeah. all the guys that, that do this and and uh, we're, we're making the most of these double headers, and uh, hopefully we can go have a, another good solid afternoon. If we go to victory lane today, yeah. I can promise you they won't be too tired. Yeah, exactly right, Chris. A short <laughs> night for the race teams, but if you sweep the weekend, it's all worth it. Yeah.